Brent, I'm coming. Where's the fire? Jeez. What are you doing here? I wanted to tell you in person that Morgan and I are getting married. Yeah, I know. AJ told me last night. So, uh, congratulations. When's the wedding? No, I haven't. Why are you being like this? What do you want me to say? You and I can't be together. So marrying Morgan will put an end to us. So you proposed to Morgan to get over me? No, I didn't propose to him. He asked me. When Morgan left me at Kelly's yesterday, he was furious with the both of us because I told him that we kissed. Yeah, no kidding. I was expecting a fight when I found Morgan, and instead he dropped down on one knee and proposed to me. How, how did Morgan go from being furious to fiancé? I have no idea. All you After you told me that Morgan went looking for me to talk about the kiss, I went to go find Morgan. I looked in the boathouse, I looked in the main house, and that's where he found me. And I immediately told him that I knew that he knew about our kiss. And what'd he say? Michael, he wouldn't even let me explain. He, for some God only knows reason, got down on one knee and proposed to me. And you said yes? It's for the best, Michael. We can't keep doing this. We can't keep having feelings for each other like this. I, I need to move on. And you need to move on. Right? Michael, are you coming back to... Oh, you've got company. So you think... Kiki, this is Penny. Penny, this is, this is Kiki, uh, my cousin. Oh, your cousin. Oh, for a minute there, I thought you were the girl Michael's trying so hard to get over. How awkward would that have been, right? Right, listen, I gotta go. Can you wait? Go with me, you're obviously busy. I wasn't gonna bring Penny home last night, okay? Then I thought you and Morgan are getting married. I didn't see- Okay, you're busy. moving on too, right? That's great. Go and enjoy, I have to see my dad. Michael. I'm gonna head out. Oh yeah, yeah, I think I'm gonna head out too, actually. It seemed intense between you and your cousin. I feel like I walked in on something. Uh, and this is Kiki's, uh, her dad's in the hospital and, and, and it's really tough on her. You can't go in. Dr. Drake's in there. But my fiance's Franco's daughter. I'm sure she's in there too. I can guarantee she isn't. Wow. Should've known. Should've known what? Yeah, hey, I was worried about you. How's your dad? What are they? Why are they going into your dad's room? I don't know. Well, haven't you been here all morning? Franco? What are you doing here? Where are you going? I'm gonna have a little surgery. A little surgery? You don't need to worry. I, I got someone looking out for me. She already saved my life once. She's kind of my secret weapon. What's going on? Why do you need surgery? So that I can be a dad. Just like that, you make it worth it. I'm sorry, we need to go. Is he going to die? So my dad's going to die. Patrick is a brilliant surgeon. I've seen him work miracles. And that's what he needs, a miracle? Well, the size and the placement of the tumor makes it extremely risky. Oh my god. Hey, hey. I'm sorry, baby. For I just started to get to know him. What if he dies? Then we'll handle it together. Okay? I'm here for you now. I always will be now that I'm your fiance. What did you say? Uh, Mom, I, I, I'm sorry. I just did. Things have been crazy, so I haven't had the chance to tell you, but Kiki and I are getting married. I'll see you around. Or not. Bye, Michael. Bye. Oh, uh, the best I expected when I introduced you two last night was some flirty banter. I guess you two really hit it off. At least for one night we did. Uh, 
I'll see you at work. Yeah. <laughs> Michael, you got game. Cool, huh? hmm. I'm guessing you didn't stop by here to see if Penny and I are a match made in heaven. So what are you what are you doing here? I didn't come over to see if you and Penny rocked the paint off the walls. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to come off defensive. <sighs> Obviously, you're a gentleman. I approve. Otherwise, I wouldn't have introduced you to Penny. The last thing I need is a co-worker who's uh, holding a grudge because of a bad date. Well, Penny's... Penny's nice. I'm glad you think so. Uh, and since it seems like I did you a favor, I think the timing's right for me to ask for one in return. And what is that? I need your help. It's Frank. Kiki and I are getting married. Over my dead body. I need your help. Okay, with what? I need to speak with you about Bert Westbourne. My plan did fail, which is why I've made a new one. There's a chance that Franco could die before he saves Danny's life. 